You ever wake up and some days you just don't feel like working out? We all know what happens is that once you let one day turn into two days, two days turns into the week, a week turns into I'll just start next Monday, and next Monday never comes. In today's video, I wanna to talk to you about how you can find joy in doing your workouts. So number one is that you need to recognize that working out is a privilege and not a right. There are many people that cannot afford it or they truly just don't have the time. Now I'm sure they can find a way to make it happen, but if you're a single mother, raising five kids alone, working two jobs and having no family support, then you truly don't have the time or resources to dedicate 30 minutes a day to your fitness routine. Not that it hasn't been done, but the obstacles are just very high. Now compare your day to that person's day and your worst day is their best day. And as such, we need to be grateful and thankful that we have the opportunity to work out. So that's number one, is that we need to be grateful for the things that we have right now. Number two is that working out is just an instant reward. Like what you just did for yourself is something great. It's amazing. It's something that's progressing you forward. You know you only get healthier, you get fitter, you get stronger, you help with your mindset a little bit more every single workout that you did. So the second thing that you need to do is recognize that you just did something awesome for yourself, but it won't happen unless you make it. So use that as your motivation to get to the gym because you know that the reward is so big versus sleeping in or taking a day off. Number three, and I always tell anybody new that if you're sore, think about being sore as getting sexy. Every workout that you're getting is an opportunity for you to even get more sexier. Your ass hurts, boom, your booty's getting nicer. Your arms are sore, bye bye bat wings. Remember, sore equals sexy. Number four, and this is probably my favorite, and I know it's Neri's favorite, is that you get to eat, right? Now, you can't out-train a poor diet. We all know that. You can't have Wendy's and McDonald's and then Burger King all in the same day and expect that your 30-minute workout is going to eliminate all that junk food. It's just not. But at least if you're being consistent with your nutrition and you're working out at least five days a week, then you're building muscle, you're boosting your metabolism, and more importantly is that you're burning more calories so you get a bigger budget to eat. And number five, probably the most important thing that you need to continue to say to yourself is that health is wealth. You gotta look at as every workout that you do is that you're depositing into the positive lifestyle bank. So you gotta ask yourself is, how do you wanna relive the rest of your life? How do you wanna live your later years? Do you wanna be dependent on other people, where they gotta go and grocery shop for you, they gotta come in and pick out your clothes, maybe even dress you, you know, you're living in a home where people have to serve you and you're not even that old? Or do you wanna be one of those inspirational people that are older, they're totally capable on their own, in fact, they're doing things that people half their age aren't doing. So you gotta understand that health is wealth and that you're gaining a quality of life. And you gotta think, you want to live the life now so that when you get older, you're proud of all the actions that you did at this moment. So there we have it, guys. I give you five practical tips and advice and motivation for that matter of how to find joy in doing your daily workouts. Now, before you go, give the video a like and we'll see you on the next one.